blessings into your world and welcome. So the mystic link and sync. And we're still setting up the scene here. And today I want to share with you a little bit about what brought me here. How did the mystic find me in some way? So we're all clear. The mystic is the one that surrenders. The mystic is the one that dares to fully go into the divine and reinstall and recreate these connections that have once been lost. So, how did this happen for me? There is four points I'm sharing with you. One is the little Patrick always could see these beautiful mystical creatures in nature mostly. So from a dragonfly that seemed to be a dragonfly but really it would share a story with me. Or I would see a phoenix or I would see a unicorn and they actually communicate with me. So when I shared that as a youngster, you can imagine, or even when I was writing it down, I said, oh, this guy is a little bit weird, and this guy has too much fantasies, but for me, they really came to me, and they really came to me as mystical beings to help me from a very young age to open up to that link that allowed me to stay connected to the divine during all my life. The second time I was looking for training as a shaman. I felt shamanism was one of the things that would fit very well into all the other things that I had done on my journey. And I couldn't really find the kind of course that I really wanted. So finally I came across a course. It's a Mesa carrier, comes originally out of the Four Winds, based in Peru, from the Quieros, up in the mountains of the Andes. And my course wasn't really called Shaman or, or Quiero or Mesa Carrier. My, my course was called the Practical Mystic. So here I was again. A couple of years later, when I first endeavored to have a website and leave everything and really dedicate my life to this, mystic journey of the heart. The first name of the website that I've ever had was actually Mystical Bliss. And yes, when I really feel that presence, that link, that connection, I can feel that mystical bliss. So this was the next time it came and not so long ago, number four, came the mystic heart. And those of you who follow, they know I spell the A in the center of the heart, capital. So it means literally both things. It's the heart, as in the heart, the center of everything, and also the art that comes from the heart. So you see, mystic was something I couldn't really run away from, and these are just the four main points. So what is your mystic link? Let me know below, and I also share some things how you can enjoy more that mystic link and sync to you. Thank you for today, from my heart to yours.